again. He must be far more aggressive in his step. That's a far better step from him there. Good angle. The way they come with Warwick, and then at pace to the elusive De Villiers. Ten step. Warwick again. Missing out Mick O'Driscoll and going instead. Warwick under pressure from Paddy Wallace. Danielli has it. And Danielli has a clear run for the try line. No one's going to stop him. Well, it came from the mistake from Munster. Simon Danielli showed good awareness and he found an empty corner order run up along the line and in for the try after 18 and a half minutes. Ulster lead by eight points to nil. Well, a very soft try to get away. You just see Peter Stringer there. The intention from Warwick was to put the ball in behind a little chop, uh, chip for Dougie Howler, but then himself and Howler just fell over each other, and really, that's a poor mistake from Warwick. He should be drilling the ball down into the corner, trying to get out of uh, Ulster territory, and um, that's a very soft try. And then the two players colliding with each other certainly didn't help, but uh, Munster, despite playing a lot of the rugby so far, finding